All right, internet friends. Um, here, what you're seeing is color bars coming from my leader pattern generator. I guess it doesn't matter. Like I can press, I can press whatever. It doesn't make any difference. It's all fucked up, right? That's the point. But the color bars are big and and straight, and it's fine. So. I have this monitor set up to do horizontal frequency adjustment. There's a little jig. You see the yellow and white wire. It's right next to the uh, sync separator chip. And so you read the instructions. And, uh, and it says you connect pin 1 of the chip to ground with a capacitor uh, in line. And I think I could build like a little jig that actually just plugs in there and it's like, you know, I don't have to worry about it. But uh, I have to figure out how that plastic socket works and where I can find one where I could build the jig. That would be neat. But some of the PVMs require you to just short it. Some of them require you to short more than one thing. It just depends on the, you have to look it up in your service manual. But currently I have pin 1 shorted to ground with that capacitor, no problem. And so, you can tell it's wrong. I don't know how this happened, because I, I swear I did this already. Um, probably because every time I touch it, something goes wrong. It tells you how sensitive some of these things are. Um, you can tell it's wrong because it's not straight. So the idea, we're going to go back here... La 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 la. Ceramic screwdrivers. There is no chance of survival without ceramic screwdrivers. Just, just, just to let you know. So, oh, see, I keep turning it wrong. It becomes more horizontal. So we turn it the other way. You can see it. Well, see, we went the we went too far, right? I think that's just. I mean, without. Oh, of course, I touched it. That's pretty good. It's very sensitive. Like, I'm pretty sure I should either... I need to buy a bunch of these trim pots. Because I don't trust these motherfuckers at all. And, uh, well, here, let's, let's just, sometimes you just gotta mess with it. I, I should have some deoxit somewhere. I should break out my deoxit. All right. The idea, if you do it right, is that it'll straighten out as if there was nothing wrong. And I've had... Varying degrees of success with this. But like I said, like, maybe there's a capacitor that would help. If it's worn out, maybe that's a problem. Maybe the, the, the trim pot itself is kind of like, it. maybe it needs just some deoxid. Maybe it needs to be replaced if the resistance has been damaged. But, the hope is that you get the image, whatever image you got. Now this is a real pattern generator, so the, the frequency is exactly right. But boy, that thing is sensitive. Woo!
There we go. I would say that's good enough. If I could get it to hold still. Like that. 